in Adams County, there are tons of services and they're all in pockets and individual places. And that's really what ECPAC focuses on, is how do we get all those systems to come together and work together so that together we can form this kind of safety net and really get some traction on prevention and early intervention so that by the time they hit school, they're ready to go. ECPAC is a partnership of community organizations, families, and other key stakeholders, such as elected officials and businesses. We work together to improve equitable access to high quality, affordable services and supports for young children and families in the areas of health, mental health, family support and education, and early learning. We work together to break down system barriers, provide professional development opportunities for higher quality services, and partnering with community organizations to provide services to fill identified gaps. So one of the things that's really interesting is that when we look at kids who get incarcerated and we start to look back, guess where they started to have trouble? Preschool. These were the kids who got kicked out of daycare. These were the kids whose parents couldn't find somebody to watch them. That is huge to think about. If somebody could have intervened when that child was struggling with behavior at a year, at two years, right? Very likely we could have prevented this incarceration that is costing us hundreds of thousands of dollars a year. And the, the cost to society for that child not being successful is just mind-boggling. A lot of times, a child may be identified with some sort of concern related to, say, their mental health or their development. And if a family is struggling with other barriers, say, transportation, they may not be in a place to be able to think about a referral for their child's development. And so it's helpful to have someone who can answer questions, really take the time to sit down with families and walk through what the process is, as well as why early intervention is so important to a child's health and development. So when we first started the Connections to Services work, the percentage of families that followed through with a referral for an evaluation for their child's development was around 52%. After we began employing care navigators in the community, our referral follow-through rates for Adams County have soared above 70%, and some clinics have been doing referral follow-through numbers around 90%. ECPAC desarrolla el fortalecimiento familiar de dos formas. La primera es a través de nuestros socios. ECPAC es una sociedad de los distritos escolares, bibliotecas, clínicas, hospitales y organizaciones comunitarias, también padres de familia. Ocupamos la ayuda de ellos para poder servir a las familias porque son ellos los que están en contacto directo con ellas. Y la segunda forma es a través de servicio directo. Ese servicio directo se desarrolla a través de clases y talleres para padres y madres o proveedores de cuidado infantil. There are so many resources out there and we just don't know about them. And that is one thing that I always try to take away, especially from the community cafe. I've had these amazing social connections where I can help somebody else and then that person helps somebody else, and then we help each other out. And that's really the culture and the community that ECPAC is creating. Podemos ver que cuando un padre o una madre se involucra con su hijo, ya sea en la lectura, ya sea en clases socioemocionales, puede impactar no solamente su pequeño núcleo familiar, sino que se extiende hacia afuera. Over the last few years, we have been working directly with ECPAC. Um, to do quality improvement at our center and we through this process have obtained a coach a quality improvement coach she's become kind of a part of our staff because she knows the teachers very well and she's built relationships with all of us and it's definitely made an impact in our center overall I think the other thing that really comes with it is our mental health consultant comes in to not only support our children and families 
but our staff. This is a very high stress field and if our staff are like, this has been a really hard week and I need some help, the coach and the mental health consultant kind of follow that up with, here's how I can help you, which then of course provides to a better quality environment where all those kidlets are. I had a student who uh, was having some significant behavior issues. He had the uh, label of post-traumatic stress disorder. A lot of transitions scared him. A lot of things triggered him to um, throw fits, push things, push furniture. I took a guiding strategies class at the Front Range through the ECPAC program, and we were able to observe him, know how to observe and take proper notes, and knew what, what transitions were real big triggers for him and what we could do in the classroom to change things for him. By the end of spring semester, he had a lot of strategies for himself to help him feel in control and feel like there was a structure for him, and that brought him peace. Cuando nosotros recibimos este, estos entrenamientos, eh, nos, eh, se muestra o sale a relucir cuando nosotros proveemos los servicios. Y tenemos una comunidad de profesionales que están educados y que saben bien qué es lo que está pasando en nuestra profesión. El resultado es que las familias reciben un nivel de servicio con mucha más altura. Eso causa en efecto general en la comunidad, porque la, la comunidad entera seguimos este, saliendo adelante. Kids can't be siloed and families can't be siloed. You have, to, you have to look at the whole system and you have to support the whole system. That's the beauty of prevention and early intervention, is a little bit of money goes a really long ways. And again, the impact is so tremendous. ECPAC partners believe that healthy children come from strong families, and strong families come from thriving communities. The ECPAC partnership is very dedicated to making sure that Adams County is a place where every young child and their family can reach their full potential.